Howdy and welcome to another episode of Piano TV. So today we are going to discuss the portato, which is sort of like a staccato, sort of like a legato, sort of like a potato, sort of like a patata. I'm getting carried away. So let's just jump into it. So here's a portato phrase. You'll notice it's, it's basically just a combination of a slur, which is legato, and staccato markings. So the how to play it is somewhere in between the two as well. So the word portato translates roughly into carried or ported. So it can be thought of as an extended staccato. I've heard it described as non-legato or sticky staccato as well. So the point of portato is to give the phrase sort of a pulsing sound, whereas staccato might make it sound light and choppy, the slur might make it sound smooth and graceful, the portato is to almost emphasize the notes a little bit. But let's go to the keyboard so you can hear what that sounds like. I'm going to start by playing this phrase legato, so completely smooth. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in the complete opposite direction and play it staccato. All right, so immediately, hopefully, the difference between the tone of the two should be clear. But what about portato? So I'm gonna play it as it's intended to be played, and you can hear what that sounds like. When you play portato, it's, it's somewhere in between a staccato and legato. It sounds pulsed or emphasized or just a little bit more stated. Portato has an excellent effect when you're using the damper pedal. So here's pedal with just a regular legato phrase, the same one. All right, now I'm gonna pedal it with a portato kind of emphasized motion. Can you hear the difference at all? It's subtle, but the pedal, it carries the tone, but the attack and release of the key makes creates like a pulsing sound. So it's just one of many different touches and techniques composers might employ in their pieces. And that is all for today's video. In the next video, we're gonna learn a song that uses portato so you can get practicing that as well. Hopefully you found this video useful. And as always, you can subscribe or visit the blog pianotv.net where I post all these videos and other stuff too. Take care.